Well, a group of supporters rallied outside a courthouse in Detroit today. They claim they're fighting for justice for a young man accused of shooting Detroit police officers. And they shared their message with 7 Action News reporter Brian Abel. Brian. Well, here at the Frank Murphy Hall of Justice, you can hear behind me the chants, Justice for Jawan. That's for Jawan Plummer, the 19-year-old who shot two Detroit police officers, believing he says to be criminals on his doorstep, and he was just protecting his family. This as another step in the court process before his trial begins. No justice, no peace, till Jawan gets released. Supporters of Jawan Plummer holding a rally today outside court to protest the 19 year old's charges. Inside, the final conference before his case moves to trial. He had uh, unknowingly shot at the police officers on the, on the porch. Two of them got injured, no one was killed. And what's disturbing to me on this situation is that he's being charged, uh, Jawan Plummer's being charged with multiple felonies and faced with decades of prison term. The nightmare for Plummer and the officers arguably started three days before the April 16th shooting on the porch in the 20,500 block of Azure. Someone attempted to break into the very same home. Fast forward to that night. Plummer's family called 911 after hearing noises and thinking there was another break in across the street. Plummer says he then heard knocking on his door and was afraid. Plummer fired a shot out of a window toward the knocking. It was police at the door. But in this situation, I was trying to protect my family. Nothing more, nothing less. Officer Tyler Simmons and his partner, Matthew Winquist were hit. The circuit court trial judge will determine if Plummer's actions were reasonable given the circumstances. Obviously, he did not know that there were police officers. He showed remorse. Brian Abel, 7 Action News.